disturbing report, Project on Government Oversight. Previously, confidential records from within the Department of Homeland Security's DHS Office for Civil Rights and Civil Liberties confirms years of inadequate medical care, extensive use of solitary confinement, mistreatment of transgender individuals, shortcomings in rape and sexual assault prevention and response, inaccessible services, and other problems disclosed by people detained by ICE, Immigration and Customs Enforcement. It, it shouldn't shock you, but this is how we treat people trying to seek refuge and trying to immigrate into this country. As of this July, ICE was detaining over 30,000 people, a number that has doubled, but decreased from a record high of 55,000 people detained under President Donald Trump. We need to understand what ICE is and why it needs to be abolished. It is a criminalization of regular human beings seeking to improve their lives by coming to the United States. There's been no signs that have shown that the barbarity has a lasting effect on keeping people from coming. Right.